Hey, it's week four of fantasy football, and you're watching The Couch. Thanks for tuning in. I'm your host, Hussein Debray, and it's been a real hectic week. The craziest week in football, basically, as far as I can remember. And I got a lot of predictions right, but Deshaun Jackson and Mark Ingram didn't really come through for me. And I'm sorry. Uh, I honestly feel really bad about this, and... I, I don't even want to do the show anymore, really. Hey, I'm Replacement Brain. Make sure you guys check out the website. We have some really funny fantasy football t-shirts. We have four designs. Our first design is what would G <clears throat> I mean, uh, Tebow do? Very popular t-shirt. And this design is my favorite, the Nadamican Poo. As you can see, it's very fashionable, very funny, and looks awesome. And this design is I Got a Big Gronk. Yeah. And this design here is the Gronkosaurus design. It's a mix between Rob Gronkowski and a T-Rex. Buy it now. And here are the waiver wire pickups for week four. The Cardinals defense is playing very well and a great start the next four weeks. They're facing Miami, St. Louis, Buffalo, and Minnesota. Kyle Rudolph makes the waiver wire list again as he was on the past two videos. So if you haven't picked him up by now, pick him up. Martellus Bennett makes the waiver wire pickup again as well. He was there in week two. Jacoby Jones is a good pickup in deep leagues. I'd say 14 man leagues or deeper. Russell Wilson. Now this is a pickup in deep leagues or dual quarterback leagues. Bye weeks actually start week four, so remember that. Russell Wilson is a decent start the next three weeks as he faces the Rams, Panthers, and Patriots. Now let's take a look at our Twitter question. These refs... Uh... That's inappropriate! Now for our rotono.com question of the week. Should I trade Alfred Morris and Deshaun Jackson for AJ Green? AJ Green's an elite wideout, so I'd say yes, do this trade. I'd say 90% of the time I start a running back in the flex position, but if it's a PPR league, I mean, you could start a wideout, sometimes even a tight end, and that's not a bad choice in PPR. And that's all the time we have for this show. Make sure you guys check out the website, fantasycouch.com. Check out our new content coming. We got our weekly stardom sit-ems, IDP, our weekly couch potato articles, and lots more. And don't forget to show your support by copping one of these funny fantasy football t-shirts.